Good morning ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the fun Bridgepoint tournament. This video contains 10 boards with imp scoring. You can get into mind of a bridge professional and teacher, Milan Matsura. Have fun! Hello everyone, welcome to the Fun Bridge Point tournament. It's Thursday, which means that we play 10 boards with imp scoring. First board, 17 high card points in a balanced hand. That's a standard 1 0 trump opening, kind of automatic with 4 triple 3. Partners asking for the full card major, we don't have it, and we play in 3 no trumps. 9 tricks. Should be relatively easy with dummy a 12 high card points. So we are on the edge uh, with the slam. The lead is quite favorable, although we had only four diamonds, we might have even three stoppers. So actually the goal here is to play for a good defender and a bad defender. Anyway, Four club tricks, two diamond tricks is six, two spades is eight, so I need to establish only one trick. Uh, that might be uh, the spade or it might actually be the heart. It's all about the tempo and letting the good guy in or a bad guy. So if I lose the trick to West, it's okay because he cannot play the diamond. Otherwise, he gives me another trick. If East wins the trick, so for example, I play the heart towards the king and East wins, then uh, they will play the diamond through and very likely West has the jack and uh, then I would need to, well, uh, cash my tricks with no extra chance for over tricks. So what I will do is I will just cash like two rounds of clubs, maybe not necessary, but I hope that they will play a heart for me or a diamond. So this way uh, I get to the dummy and play a spade towards the jack. I feel that the queen might be with east, although he already had a king, so well, let's have a look. But I don't mind losing to west. Um, I did not. And we see the three of spades and a seven of spades. That means that East has either doubleton queen or four spades. And West might have either double to nine or three too small. Um, can I actually use that as an advantage? I would love to get an entry. I feel that the Ace of Hearts might be actually with West. So if I, because I have only one entry with the club to the north, if I play the heart and play the Ten of Spades, East covers with the Queen. I will win with the king and the nine comes, then I have both winners. If the two comes and I play a low spade and west follows, I can finesse there. So I'll try to do that. I already secured my contract. So now I'm playing for over tricks. I would love to get two over tricks. So let's see. Hard will be one. Unfortunately, I don't get the extra diamonds. See, that's a pity. If I played the heart immediately, I will be in troubles. This way, I still have some time. There we go. Okay, so right now I can try the squeeze. So I can cash two rounds of clubs, see what they discard. Because East probably uh, keeps the spades. So then he will keep the spades. Um, yeah, I'm not sure if I actually can do anything. 
I think I I might not. Here we go, two of spades. Now I can actually play the ten. Not that it matters. Because out of spades break, but more likely east has the fourth queen. Because west still has some diamonds. And the ten of hearts, I guess. Oh, wait. Here comes the queen. And two over tricks. As promised. I guess I couldn't do more. There was no hard diamond squeeze. So it's fine. Two over tricks should be an imp. Two imps, even. Uh, great start, because uh, see that 310 players... Uh, basically everybody played in no trumps, people made 9, 10, more often, most often uh, 11 tricks, 2 imps, a good start, gain an imp on the majority of the field or half of the field, 1 diamond, 16 high card points but 4 triple three. I've got, if I am a little bit optimistic, four maybe four and a half if i'm very optimistic on a tricks plus one length trick so like a super optimistic thing is that i have four tricks five tricks sorry um pardon is a past hand they are vulnerable i will score all my tricks in defense as well so do I want to interfere here? I would like to push them a little bit higher. Uh, but still we can have a... Well, most likely we will not have a game. Uh, but partner might have five card major, so I will overcall 1-0 Trump. But I'm really not happy about that. See, now partner has five hearts. Yeah. Letting them play two spades is a little bit cowardish. Points most li likely are 20 20. They might have the slight advantage, but we have a fit. The issue is that my trumps are useless. I don't have a chance to rough anything. So if, if we get four hard tricks. Even if Barton has just the jack or nothing. Two aces, that's six. If Barton gets one trick, that's seven. I go down two for a hundred. If I'm not doubled, um, I think it's not worth it. If Barton has a trick, we might beat two spades. Let's see. Oh, this is wonderful. But the hearts, good for the defense. Yeah, let's win and try to get the diamond trick. Okay, nothing. So I'm quite happy that I didn't bid. I feel that if we get doubled, um, it will be five, eight hundred. Let's win. There's uh, no heroic time and I will just get my heart. Yeah. And I might even push them to bid a game. Look at that. And they even have the useless king. But the ace of diamonds is on side and otherwise they just lose those aces they need only one club rough I feel this is like pretty easy letting them play 117 give me five imps okay two only uh, there was majority of players just let them play in spades didn't try any heroic things unfortunately for me but plus four but no loss. Five card spades. We don't have a hard fit, so let's try to search a spade fit. 
Barnes shows a two suitor. We have a misfit. Still, is this enough for a game? Two no trumps in general. I suggest you to play a forcing. Because right now it's a little bit better just to bit two hearts or two spades and let's north and wide. Uh, because then it's very tough to bid slams. If you bid three clubs or even the, the proper games. Because I would love to bid two spades and wait if partner just by coincidence have three spades. It's more likely that he has 5-4-2-2 two, two, or 5-4-3-1 with singleton spade. And since this is imps... And I potentially have four honor tricks. I just bid a game. Let's hope that the hearts will be running. Oh, spade. That's a very nice lead. And what else? Four. Yeah, I don't have really good entries. Eight. Jack. I think it's quite important here. To remember the small cards. So better say it out loud. 5, 8, Jack. Because then if you need it, you will remember better. I will play the Queen. Hearts might actually split 5, 2. So I will play the Queen and duck it. Because I want to play the Diamond Finesse. Oh wow, this is actually quite good. Although now... No good entries, but look, opponents have to play something. So right now I just cash those hearts. How many tricks do I have? Three, six, seven, eight, nine. So I can either lose two diamond tricks or they give me something. So no issue. Let's just dump the spade. Don't want to discard the diamonds. So, mm, I want to keep the club as well. I'll play a low diamond. So, I'll discard a spade. Let him discard spades as well. And right now, I'll dump a diamond. So, What's the best strategy now? Is it cashing the Ace of Diamonds and exit with the Diamond? Because then they have to give me those two tricks. Or to play a low Diamond. If Diamonds are 4-1 and the guy with 4 takes a trick and play a Diamond, I will end play them as well. But I would have to guess. Yeah, but if I lose and they play, for example, if I lose to West and he plays another diamond and I duck, they split, I might lose a club. So it's actually better to play the Ace and a small one. That's a guarantee that I will win the contract. And I'm in the vulnerable game, so let's, uh, yeah, okay. I'd rather make see if I played a low diamond I would have made an over trick possibly two over tricks actually or not I lost a club oh one over trick anyway plus 10 I think pretty good be aggressive bit vulnerable games and then don't mess around if you have nine tricks in a vulnerable game, just cash it. See that uh, Arjun is telling me that I could play a low diamond uh, and drop the doubleton king behind, which was definitely option. I will do that in match points, but this way it was guaranteed that I will make the vulnerable game. Great gain of 10 M's. 11, now uh, we know that with Arjun it's not worth open uh, 11. And right now it's a major game. I have a doubleton, we have control over diamonds, so you cannot shorten us. I've got three honor tricks, possible discards of hearts on clubs. 
Mm. And spade finesse potentially working. Uh, once again, I will just jump to four clubs. Hopefully they bid five diamonds. That would be the best for me. Uh, guaranteed doubled contract. Right now we lose a diamond. We don't lose a heart. We will lose a spade. Hopefully only one. And then uh, maybe a club. So this looks pretty optimistic. Do I play the club first? The Ace of Diamonds is with West. I think I just exit with a diamond. I have to lose it anyway, right? I don't want them to keep the communication. They play a club, I have to duck. If they play a heart, I win. And I have to play a spade. Come on, okay. So now get an entry to the south hand with a club five and a king okay well this is very good no no I should have played the ten this is very unfortunate for one split yeah if I play the ten and duck it around the table Playing for the ace jack on side. I would make. Maybe West will cover. I would need to finesse jack nine later on. Um, pity. Okay, this was worth 13 imps. Maybe, <coughs> sorry, maybe a bit more. Yeah, well, this this hand is rubbish. But I couldn't do much unless guessing the spades correctly. I have to discard the heart later on on the club. So, yeah, see, I lose an imp. The majority of players made nine. Somebody who will be at the tops of the ranking made ten. But we will see if they bed the game or not I wondered at least I played quite decent uh, 15 high card points opponents bid both red suits I have two full cards in the black suits so I will take out double in general the rule is that if you double and there are three suits partner might bid you should have three cards in uh, all suits if there are two suits to bid you should have four cards in both suits or like a super strong hand this is something in between if partner has a spade and hard shortness if we have a spade fit uh, once again it could have been an aggressive game um, not after this bidding Okay, they went third level voluntarily, so it's fine. The free is either a singleton or a free card. Okay. If it is a free card, then West might have five diamonds, four spades. Two hearts and two clubs. He's drawing trumps. So what's his strategy? Establish the suits. Does he have a jack? 
I don't think so. Yeah, he has a singleton. Pity. Does he does he have four 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 one actually? If he has a four 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 one. Which how he's playing, he might actually. I might play a low club, partner roughs. Play the last trump, potentially a winner, and play a spade through. Because this guy already roughed, uh, roughed a heart. Ah, he has a five five. Six, sorry, six, four. Okay, I lost a couple of tricks here in the defense. But six, four, two, one. We could have cashed one, two, three, four tricks. Yeah, I gave away an imp. It's only 40, non vulnerable. I played to beat it. Okay, anyway, lost an imp. Yeah, see, like a very bad defense. I didn't catch two aces or a club uh, and the ace of heart. <laughs> yeah, but I don't mind that much to lose an imp or tie this board. Previous one, previous two. Uh, were definitely more interesting. Four triple three, twelve count. This is just a terrible hand to open. Yet again, I feel I might just bid one no trump. But I have a twelve count. Let's wait. Yeah. Uh, we know four suit, two no trumps, three no trumps. Okay, so that's that's what we wanted. Play three no from north. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Uh, pretty easy. We played from the right side, although the king of spades was well positioned. Imagine that I open a diamond, partner bids a heart, I have to bid a no trump. I play. Imagine I bid no trumps after a heart. Um, then they can just cash five spade tricks. Uh, right now, I will try to squeeze them. For three over tricks. First heart. Spade. I was not paying that much attention on how many spades there are. Left two spades, uh, eight spades gone, two discarded. That's ten, eleven. So there are still two spades left. Two hearts gone. More hearts gone. Nobody discarded diamonds. They saw them. So the guy who has four will keep them. Somebody had five, he might be squeezed there. So I believe that the heart is a winner. Yeah. So this guy was squeezed in diamonds and hearts. Stolen over trick, good for match points. Only imp here. See, 12 tricks, the maximum two extra imps. Still, um, have to wait and be patient for another big swing which might come right now i have two stoppers six cards i have eight tricks so i definitely want to be in free no trumps here so let's just start with one even i have a singleton two spades uh let's go free no and hope that partner will not bit clubs and hope pardon brings me a trick. Oh, double. I will. I will stick. Pardon, please. I 
I have this under control till I have my partner a computer. <laughs> what now? If I bid four diamonds. I mean, I have my eight tricks uh, in no trumps or in diamonds, but not in clubs. I want to. I want him to pass for diamonds, and I'm not even doubled, so that's fine. Ah, partner has an entry. Poof, and a trick. Three no trumps doubled. That would be a awesome contract. Oh, this is a strange switch. Six twenty-two. Cause if I play low and this guy wins with the queen. You will play the spade through. I might lose a heart and I might lose a spade. But I cannot lose two hearts and a spade. Okay. That worked out. And I still need to rough the heart. Okay, both on side. Pity. Do I want to rough a club just in case? Um, no, it can. It would need to be six five. No, I guess not. I'm pretty sure that East has the King of Spades. But I'm so sad that we were not playing in free. No trumps doubled. I want to keep my seven. It has been a long time since I got my beer card. I want to enjoy it. Come on. So what would be the lead? After a spade lead, I have nine tricks. After a club, they don't have a switch. So I always have two hearts or I always have two spades. Uh, I don't have an entry. Six, seven. Uh, if they lead a club and switch to a heart still have an entry to establish a heart or a spade they just have four tricks so uh pity now i scored 130 instead of 750 i lose an imp how fair is that maybe i should have bit diamonds first and then bit three no trumps my fourth partner will stick with it when i bit like this Anyway, pity. 19. That's a strong hand. 1, 2, 3, 4. Theoretical losers. A couple of finesses. Yet, those theoretical losers will work only if I have an entry to the north hand. Can afford to bid on third level, so that's fine. This way I will show the strong hand with 5 spades. Um, and right now, if partner has five clubs with the king, we might have a game. What was this? Nobody knows. This is also nobody knows. I don't I really don't know. Six two. Let's hope. First good news. 
Let's try the second good news, because if the finesse is on, I have an entry. And, yep, I can cache it. I have those entries. Yeah. Doesn't work. Oh, even, even this finesse works. But right now, I don't have all the discards. I'll try to steal a trick. They know the shape, so I don't think that this will work. But if they do not jump with the ace, I will establish the spades. Okay, even a club slam. So the bidding was quite fine. Even if I play in free no, and I guess the diamonds, it will be enough. But I had troubles with entries. Good that East had troubles with leading. Plus three, not like a great gain, but it's a plus. So let's accept it. Two more boards to go. I missed two super swings. Okay, one diamond. I've got 15. Let's try to find the hard fit. Parton doesn't have four hearts, so we just play in free no trumps. That's it. Uh, we didn't get the spade lead, which is good. And uh, yet four, seven, eight, nine. This is fine. They cannot get all the clubs. So let's just try the hard finesses. Two and three diamonds are not splitting badly and they will potentially establish a club trick for me fine the spade finesse works but now i don't even need it oh claim refused just to be sure i can just do it like this way no wait I kind of did it wrong. This way I will not get my diamond seven. Ah. Ah, I didn't have I didn't have a good entry. I can play the spade finesse, right? The spade is hundred percent on. I want my beer cards. <laughs> I lost an imp. I lost an imp and a beer. No, wait, I didn't lose the beer. Okay, that's fine. I got my, my beer card. I have to finish. I have to finish the game. I lost an imp! Ah, they really didn't lead a spade. If, if they led a spade, I mean, I'm down, so... Even... Even, like, making free no trumps might be okay. And... Let's get the beer! Woo, woo, woo! I made the contract, that's important. Okay, so the beer is justified only if this is plus, if this is minus. It's not it was not worth it plus four okay uh, I lost an imp but if that brings me a beer I mean I take it I take and it might not even be an imp because the average might be somewhere uh, in between 400 and 440 or no it will be a little bit less so if it is four imps uh, then the 30 might not at the end matter so i think it was a good try definitely worth if i get a beer 
Ten. Wait. Okay, do we have a major fit? We do. I have a full card and a shortness. Partner will have a shortness in clubs. And this is vulnerable. Last board. This is a must bid game. Yes, we have 10 count. But look, we lose two club tricks. And hopefully only one heart. Ooh, though, it might be quite tricky. West overcalled. And has ace, king, queen. So now we know that east actually has the king of hearts. So how high do we rough? I need West to have what? Singleton nine or singleton jack. Then I need to rough with the ten. If he has a double to nine. Then I need to rough with the six. Doubleton Jack, I need to. No, Doubleton Jack doesn't help. Okay, so we know about six clubs. The three of diamonds looks like a five card, which will give West a three card diamonds. Six three. So it can be six three two two or six three three one. So, singleton 9 or singleton jack, I can rough with the 10. Doubleton 9, doubleton jack doesn't uh, help, so I have to rough with the 10. I think this is a percentage play. Let's drop it. Drop it! Oh, pity. Double to nine! Ah, then I needed to rough with the small one. Which people will do. Uh, not fair. This is not fair. I played. I played on the percentage. I probably guess the distribution correctly like 6331 um, let's give it to them okay i hate it they got the promotion they don't play three rounds of clubs i will play the queen of hearts and i will finesse the 10 so there would be no problem. See, six clubs, three diamonds, I guessed it right. So it had to be either 2-2 two, two, or 3-1. If it is 2-2, two, two, I needed exactly the doubleton 9. Because if there is a doubleton jack, I rough small, they will over rough with the 9 and they always get one extra heart trick. So if there is a doubleton jack, I rough with the 10, um, they don't over rough and um, then they will get two hard tricks so yeah there was no way this was the only case where it is good to rough small pity three big gains this one was worth 15 imps Still, I mean, I'm plus 16, plus 1.6 average, but I could have like 30, 40, 55, something like that, if I get all three swings right. So let's have a look if somebody did it. Yeah, I saw an amazing 61 imp. 
Merek. Wow. Seems to me a little bit even too much. It's getting everything right. Robbie Lobby. Nicholas here over 50 and Yeter over 50. See that that's that one board extra difference. The rest do uh, gains over 30. That's simply like one board out of those three. There I could um, gain the big swing. Yeah, pity. Uh, definitely a very nice tournament. I enjoyed these boards. So they were nice. Congrats uh, to Vidar and Yoram yet again in top 10. Wow. It seems like Yoram and Johan actually. I see them so often there in the top 20 or even top 10. That they are doing really well. Congrats. Anyway, guys, uh, thank you for watching. And uh, if you are still interested uh, in some more bridge than uh, you already know, or you might have uh, checked it out, that uh, I have a website here. Sorry, this is not the right uh, screen which I'm sharing. Uh, this is the right one. Uh, milanbridge.com um, then if you get to the member section and register get your profile you can just fill it in and that's actually uh, nice here if you fill in uh, your bridge information uh, then you can uh, check out that you want to be shown on the partnership desk and that's what we have like the new uh, feature here that you can find uh, people here who are registered and you can play the challenges again um, you can ask them to join the team on fun bridge uh, you can play uh, team spares on into bridge on bbo so this is the way where you can find uh, partners all over the world and of course the best benefit is that you might just play the mmba standard with them which is described uh, here already quite thoroughly uh, with the general bidding strategies approaches uh, already with uh, some later on system descriptions and more more will come so don't worry uh, this will be all filled in and supported with videos practices uh, and more in the future so join guys you will not regret Thank you for watching, uh, have a nice weekend, cross fingers, because uh, I will be playing the finals of the Czech National League, a very important uh, tournament uh, for me, uh, and I will tell you the results um, on my webpage in the blog, uh, or on Tuesday's super live stream on Funbridge YouTube channel. Ciao guys.